Hi, it's Katie Harris from Philly Wellness Center, and today we're we're continuing our talk about cell membranes, and uh, today we're going to talk about how to protect them and supercharge them for life. So your body's electric. Uh, every heartbeat, every nerve single signal, every thought depends on voltage. That's an invisible current that runs through your cell membranes. Uh, we know it's there. I mean, you see it on EKG, you see it on EEG. It's, there's voltage in the body. So we talked about how cell membranes break down uh, and how to rebuild them. So let's talk about how do we keep them charged for life so that your energy, focus, and vitality stay strong no matter what your age is, right? So a healthy cell membrane holds a charge at negative 70 millivolts. That charge is what allows nutrients to flow in, toxins to move out, and mitochondria to stay efficient. When you protect that voltage, you protect life itself. So how do we do that? Like practically every day. Let's break it down. One, you need to feed the membranes the right kind of fats. So your membranes are made of fat, as you know, but not just any fat. They depend on real building blocks. So all the things that they told us that were bad 20 years ago are now good, and they've always been good, but that's egg yolks, sardine, grass-fed butter, olive oil, uh, lithocin. They provide the phospholipids and cholesterol that your cells need. You want to avoid seed oils, canola oil, soybean, safflower, um, margarine, I don't even know what that is, uh, some kind of chemical <laughs> put together in a stick, but uh, they oxidize easily and they make the membranes brittle. And then you want to support with phosphatidylcholine plasmalogens um, to keep that structure and signaling strong. So food is information. Every bite changes the architecture of your cells. Two, you want to protect your voltage, right? So voltage drops when you lose electrons. You lose electrons through stress, through poor sleep, through dehydration, inflammation. You can recharge your body through nature's simplest tools, right? It doesn't have to cost you any money or even really any time, but sunlight in the morning, something as simple as that. It sets your circadian rhythm and activates mitochondrial biogenesis. Movement and oxygen. So getting exercise, red light therapy, ozone, and deep breathing feed your mitochondria grounding. So this has been popular because people talk about grounding shoes and grounding sheets and should I get them and blah, blah, blah. But you know what real grounding is? It's walking barefoot or spending time in nature. And that literally will replenish your electrons and it doesn't cost you anything. You don't even need shoes. You know, in fact, you, you don't want to have shoes on. You want to walk in the dirt. Uh, mineral hydration. So clean water with magnesium, potassium, and trace elements and minerals. Um, help maintain that electrical gradient because your body is literally a living battery and every one of these practices will charge it. So, and number three, you want to calm the nervous system. So stress burns voltage faster than anything. So when you're stuck in fight or flight, the body can't repair. So build rituals that bring you back into that sympathetic balance, slow breathing, meditation, laughter, community sleep. That's how your cells know that they're safe and they can start healing. So at this point, you can see a pattern. It's not just about chasing the next supplement or detox. It's about protecting the interface, the membrane where chemistry meets electricity. That's where longevity really begins. So at Philly Wellness Center, that is our mission, to help you live with high voltage, to protect your membranes, to power your mitochondria, and restore the, star the spark that keeps you alive. Because when your cells are charged, your life is charged, and that's what's true wellness feels like, a body in perfect electrical harmony. Be sure to subscribe to the Mitochondria Code to uh, learn more and get more information about your cells.